Hi, in this video, I am going to demonstrate how to configure OAuth 2 authentication in pgadmin4 with GitHub. I have installed pgadmin in server mode on Ubuntu platform. I have adjusted the host settings so that I can access the pgadmin using test.pgadmin.local slash pgadmin4. To configure OAuth 2, you need to first register an application with an OAuth 2 provider. In this case, it is GitHub. Let's register this application with GitHub. Here, I have already logged in to the GitHub account. Click on profile picture and select the settings option. Select the last option developer setting from the left side panel. Click on OAuth apps. Click on the new OAuth app button to register an application. Enter an application name. I will use pgadmin4 oauth2 demo. Enter http test.pgadmin.local slash pgadmin4 as a home page URL. In authorization callback URL, enter the home page URL suffixed by slash oauth2 slash authorize. Click on the register application button. Note down the client ID. Click on generate secret to create a new client secrets. Note down client secrets and click on the update application button at the bottom. Now let's configure pgadmin to use OAuth 2 authentication. Now create a config system file in slash etc slash pgadmin directory where we will add OAuth 2 configuration for pgadmin. Set the parameter authentication sources equals to internal comma OAuth 2. pgadmin supports multiple OAuth 2 configurations simultaneously. Set OAuth 2 config parameter which is a list of multiple OAuth 2 configurations where each configuration is specified inside dictionary. Let's copy and update the OAuth 2 settings from config.py documentation from the pgadmin.org website. Set OAuth2 name to GitHub as we are using the GitHub. OAuth2 display name will be shown on the pgadmin login page. Enter the client ID. Also enter the client secrets which we generated. Let's update OAuth2 token URL authorization URL, server metadata URL to the provider specific URLs, in this case GitHub. Also update the API base URL. Let's update user info endpoint to the user. Let's set OAuth 2 scope to the email. As mentioned, you can add multiple scopes separated with space, like for example, OpenID profile. OAuth 2 username claim is the claim which is used for username. By default, it takes email if we set it to none. Let's set OAuth 2 icon to the GitHub icon.
you can set what to button color save the file and restart the web server Now let's try accessing pjadmin in the browser. You can see a new button login with GitHub. Click on it. Complete the process of authentication. Once authentication is completed, you are redirected to the pjadmin homepage you are. Enter the master password to unlock saved server passwords. You can see here that you are logged in to the pjadmin with the github credentials. Click on logout button to exit. So that's it for today. Thank you.